Please be ready. We shall start the civics test now. Name one state that borders Canada. Alaska. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because they didn't have self-government. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves. Emancipation Proclamation. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Mississippi River. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Why does the flag have fifty stars? Because there is one star for each state. Who does a U.S. senator represent? All people of the state. Name one war fought by the United States in the eighteen hundreds. Civil War. How many amendments does the Constitution have? Twenty-seven. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. James Madison. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July Fourth. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July fourth, seventeen seventy-six. Who makes federal laws? Congress. What does the president's cabinet do? Advises the president. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Separation of powers. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Obey the laws of the United States. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House of Representatives. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. Who is the Commander in Chief of the military? The President. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Announced our independence from Great Britain. Who signs bills to become laws? The president. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote. Join a civic group. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War Two. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens eighteen and older can vote. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Four hundred thirty-five. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? 
fought for civil rights. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Religion. What major event happened on September 11, 2001, in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. Who vetoes bills? The President. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. When was the Constitution written? 1787. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific Ocean. We elect a president for how many years? Four. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights movement. When must all men register for the selective service? At age 18. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Name one state that borders Mexico. California. What is one reason colonists came to America? Religious freedom. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Serve on a jury. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's rights. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. How many U.S. senators are there? 100. Who was the first president? George Washington. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Agriculture, Secretary of Education. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? 
the vice president. We elect a U.S. senator for how many years? Six. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of expression, freedom of speech. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Why does the flag have thirteen stripes? Because there were thirteen original colonies. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. diplomat. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The Louisiana Territory. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War Two. What is the economic system in the United States? Market economy. In what month do we vote for the president? November. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. There were thirteen original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Cherokee. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Liberty, pursuit of happiness. Name two national U.S. holidays. Thanksgiving, Christmas. What is the political party of the president now? The Democratic Party. What is the name of the president of the United States now? Joe Biden. What is the name of the vice president of the United States now? Kamala Harris. Who is the governor of your state now? Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents should answer that D.C. does not have a governor. Who is one of your state's U.S. senators now? Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents and residents of U.S. territories should answer that D.C. or the territory where the applicant lives has no U.S. senators. What is the capital of your state? Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents should answer that D.C. is not a state and does not have a capital. Residents of U.S. territories should name the capital of the territory. Name your U.S. representative. Answers will vary. Residents of territories with non-voting delegates or resident commissioners may provide the name of that delegate or commissioner. Also acceptable is any statement that the territory has no voting representatives in Congress.